everyone, Panda Bree here. So, I watched a video of my strangest addiction, and this girl was a furry as well. So, I was thinking, hey, why not confess my strange addiction as well? So, I'm obsessed with pandas and my persona as well because I love pandas. And there's nothing wrong of being a furry. Being a furry is actually fun. And when I wear these, like the hat I'm wearing now, like when I put my hands into these paws, it like, it gives me this feeling like I'm actually my character. And it's like, it's so awesome. And it's just really great. So I have a bunch of pandas. This is my panda bear. Um, I got this on Valentine's Day, and this one was a legend. This is, this was my first panda hat I got at a fair, and um, no, it was at the Riley Festival, and this is my first panda hat I ever got. It's such a legend to me to this day. And then also, this one I got at a garage sale because it was, you know, hey, why not get a cute panda? And so this one was in Florida at a zoo market and you know I thought it was very cute and so I got it and you know these two are just really adorable and then as for this pillow right here I did not expect that they would have a pillow pet panda and I freaked out I was like oh my gosh I gotta have it and so my Nana was like that, uh, that pillow's all dirty I'm like it can be washed and so she let me get it and you know it's it, it's just it's so cute and adorable and I just really love uh, pandas and as you can see right behind me my curtains are black and white as well and I'm trying to get my room like all panda style and stuff and uh, as you can see right here my uh, blanket and bed is like uh, black and white as well so that's the first thing but anyway um, we have a special guest with us, and he's also obsessed with wolves. Like, if you walk into his room, his room is full of wolf items compared to my room. <laughs> anyway, let's welcome this, our special guest. <laughs> Hello. My name is Tito Wolf, or my old name is Evil Mouth Striker, as you all know from my old videos. Uh, I have been obsessed with wolves ever since. I mean, I have, like, wolf photos, wolf statues, two books of how wolves are, four shirts. Uh, I have, like, many wolf stuff. Like, even whenever there's a full moon, like, uh, I'm going to be howling because it's, it's one magical night when you've got a howl going on. I got pictures that are wolves, too. I got a wolf blanket. Yeah, wolf curtain, wolf everything. It's just amazing. I mean, I love wolves just as much as as panda or real life or panda. Literally, it, it's fun. It's amazing. Furries are awesome. Just want, just one thing. Just watch where you go with the furries. You might want to be the good side. And it's, I'll, I'll tell you this. It's one great feeling to have to be a furry because you feel so alive like you may be a, like an anime character or like a gamer and you're just feeling a like blum or a blob but if you join a furry you can be happy you don't have to put your emotions in like when you put your fur suit on you're going to be happy as ever you're going to be like with everyone who's there like you're not the only one everyone's out there and just to let you know, uh, Panda Bree and I are going to get our fursuit suit soon from a good friend of ours. Carly the Wolf! Yay! Indeed. It will be amazing. I always sleep with the wolf stuff. So I don't have a... I used to have a wolf stuff. Um, stuffed animal. I just don't know where it was. I'm looking around the house still, but I still got a friend. He's around here somewhere. He likes to hide. I don't know where the coda went. Yes, I named my animals too. So does Panda Bree. <laughs> and one, I mean, and I'm 
also a great motivational speaker as well. If you're feeling down or blum or like in the depressed mood ever, come to me. I am like, I'm free 24 7. I will talk to you and I will give you the best speech ever. You tell me what's going on, the whole thing, I will make you feel better by yourself. I already saved two girls already. One was Julie and one was Aphrodite Wolf. I've already saved Crane from like from like self image uh peers of self image degree of yourself. Like how you feel like, oh man, I want my body to be like that. I mean I hate, I mean I'm like okay with being muscled, but I mean I wish I was a bit fat because it like because it's just some gay people who think it's cute. I mean, but you're fine with your body. I mean, as long as you know what that person is at life, you can have, you can be with them and you can still have your body. You're both okay. Trust me, come and become a great motivational speaker. Even Panda Reno's has helped her a lot. He and that's it on my side. He definitely has. And uh, if you guys want to make a video of your strangest addiction, uh, just go ahead and tell us about it on Google. We would love to hear from you guys. And um, and that, that's going to be it. So just make a video of your guys' uh, strange addiction and just, you know, put it on Google if you want or put it on YouTube. Just tell us your story about your furry side. So that'll be it, guys. This is Panda Bree and... And we are signing off. Yeah. Have a fantastic day, everyone. Ciao!